Okay, now there's pain shooting at my left arm, which is... <laughs> Get set, go. Well, initially it's very cold. Yeah, <laughs> my initial feelings are that... That's <laughs> terrible. <laughs> it's cold. <laughs> it's nice and refreshing. This is actually quite refreshing. Yes. I feel like we're gonna get manic petties after this. <laughs> I think I have a really high pain tolerance. Uh, one time in college, I broke my foot, and I didn't know it, oh, and I walked around on it for a whole year. Wow, okay. Three <laughs> <laughs> uh, like, this is not a great experience, but I wouldn't say it's painful. I would, I would call the feeling pain. When your ears are pierced, it's pretty quick. Um, so yes, this is probably worse. Oh, no, it hurts. <laughs> I just realized this might have been a terrible idea. <laughs> okay, so now it's still just, hurting. It's still hurting, but now it's more so going numb. Mm. All right, it's starting to hurt. Yeah. You got it. Yeah. yeah. I mean, I guess I'm not sure enough to keep it in for three minutes, but I would. If I wasn't being filmed, I'd probably take it out about right now. I'm not gonna lie. I was really skeptical of this as a way to measure pain. I was like, Psh, ice water, but. This is not, does not feel good at all. <laughs> I gotta take my hand out. Okay, I'm ready. Yeah. 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 You, yeah. You can do that. It hurts. Yeah. How does the rest of your body feel? Great. <laughs> In comparison. Yeah, I mean, like my like forearm and elbow are kind of feeling it, um, but like the right side of my body <laughs> feels fantastic. <laughs> I will say the rest of my body is getting warmer, which I think hmm. is a really interesting um, yeah. scientific observation. My other hand is sort of sort of sweaty. The rest of my yeah. body is sweating right now, and my hand feels like... Actually, I don't even feel like I have a hand right now. I'm that's just like... Felt, that's what I felt like at first, I, feel, I was just like, I can't feel this. This is actually a very interesting spiritual experience. I feel very like disconnected from a piece of my body. <laughs> okay, that's three minutes. Yes. <laughs> now three minutes. Uh, <laughs> made it to three minutes. Hey. Yay! Can we take our hands out? Ah! Can we, can we stop? <laughs> Do I even have a hand oh. anymore? Hard to say whether it's a good, uh, a good measure or not. I guess if enough people do it, uh, you might be able to learn something. But it seems to me I could have kept my hand and they're taking it out. Um, I felt like I had to do the honest thing and take it out when it hurt. 23andMe had a lot of really specific guidelines for exactly how much ice to put in, how much water, the water temperature. They didn't say anything about the room temperature. And I kind of wonder if like, you're already in a cold room, maybe that makes it easier for one specific part of your body to get even colder. It'd be interesting to see like the comparison of like, if you could get it to a certain degree, like if you could control the experiment to the point where like, every bowl was the same temperature that everyone like, dipped their hands into. Yeah, and I wonder like, you know, about whether or not you live in a tropical climate mm -hmm. or grew up in New England has to do with it. It could be, it could be genetic. But also, I think it helped a lot that I was doing it with you, so yeah. I, I mean, I may have given up sooner. So maybe there's something to that as well. Teamwork. Yeah, that's right. This is my mousing hand, so I might need to get a note from my supervisor after this.